Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here. Today I'm back with another Teemo video. I've made so many Teemo reviews and I feel like I already know what's good and what's not. So today I have so, so many good things. I have like two returns. So I'm not even going to be calling this a keep or return. I'm just gonna call this like a Teemo finds and favorites. If you've never watched my Teemo videos, I have an entire playlist. You can also follow me on TikTok. I post Teemo unboxings there all the time and on Instagram, of course to keep up with me my life and now my new baby <laughs> and yeah if you've never shopped on Timo before I have like a very thorough review on the first time that I shopped there and you can also use this code to get 50% off your order Timo's great like so far so good I've been shopping there since April and I love it and as always this is not sponsored anyway that's everything I have to say let's get into it I already have these in black on Timo they're about five dollars on Amazon they're $9.99 each so you save a little bit of money and they're the exact same brand and quality. These feel so sturdy. I don't know if I'm going to keep this color or just give it to my mom. But I'm definitely keeping the black. Then I found the cutest like embroidered Dior lookalike bracelets. I got the green and pink but I'm waiting for the blues to get restocked because they are so fun. I got this bracelet both in white and pink and y'all the quality is great. I have been wearing it all week. No issues. It's so pretty and it was only $1.79 which compared to the Amazon ones are like almost <laughs> 20 bucks. This is like a great deal. Okay here are the two colors that I was telling y'all. I found the black sunglasses. They're a little dirty because Olivia was playing with them. If I had to choose the black are definitely way more flattering, like at least on me, than the beige, but I like them both. They were so cheap that I'm gonna keep both, but the black are really, really cool. And then here's the pink version of the other bracelet. I haven't worn this one yet. I honestly couldn't find it, but now that I have, I might wear both at the same time. I absolutely love getting underwear from Timu. I got this pack of six, I believe. They are seamless undies and they're more of like a bikini style I have their thongs but since i'm pregnant i'd rather just get a more full coverage one i also got this underwear set i like that these are a little bit more high rise they have that v at the front so it comes with three panties and then three matching bralettes and these look so comfortable i'm so excited to wear these these are going to be good for the weekly maternity Polaroids I've been taking. I think these are so pretty. This is probably one of my top 10 Timo finds of all time. It just solved a problem that we had when it comes to pouring this OxyClean. It also comes with a lid that we use to measure our detergent and it's really, really sturdy. It's like a nice thick plastic instead of like the alternative, which is like the cheap thin one. It like seals shut. Nothing comes out, just really, really good quality, and I got it for like $4. The last thing I need, and my husband will complain about this, is more slippers. But I couldn't resist the pink and red cowgirl set. I had to get them. They're so freaking cute, and they were $9 on Amazon. These exact slippers are $20. I've had these measuring cups and spoons for a while, and I have yet to review them on my channel. I wanted to make sure they were useful enough to have. If you have a smaller kitchen or if you're trying to declutter and have less things, you get basically everything you need to measure. Um, I will say the letters and the numbers have kind of faded with washing them in the dishwasher but you can adjust it depending on what you need so if you need like half a tablespoon you can adjust it and you have all of those measurements in one they are pretty slim and then this is the cups and it also has ounces on the side it's very very convenient i literally use this just now to make pancakes it's really really cool i got both for like five bucks and it's definitely worth it. You guys, I'm so excited for this. I saw it on TikTok. Apparently, it works great. So this is like the Timo alternative. It was only $8. And I already have tried a few different Timo devices like this that I swear by. So I'm so excited to give you guys a review on this one later on. This was in my recommended. And I had to grab it for Olivia this winter. It's like a pom-pom beanie. It also comes in black with cream or cream with tan. I got the mauve because I thought it was so cute. I'm obsessed with the quality of this 
size top but I got a size large thinking it was gonna run small and it's huge on me so I'm gonna return or exchange it I should say for a medium maybe or even a small it's super stretchy it's very deep like the V is super deep but you could also wear it like this so it's more full coverage I think this is perfect especially for the price point y'all hey, these little boxes are so good for organizing little hair accessories or even like q-tips anything for the bathroom they're so little um they open like this and they come with the mounting tape I think I'm gonna get a few more packs just so I can separate this star from the butterflies this is so cute and I do her hair like right here I have all her hair stuff so it's gonna be really easy to grab but I don't think the adhesive is that good so I might use my own mounting tape just letting y'all know I can never resist the Timo cosmetic bags they have so many and they're so inexpensive I really like this seersucker one I think I'm going to add some like sunny clever lookalike patches to it and my favorite part is that the inside is lined so it's wipeable and I would say waterproof so this is great for pool stuff for keeping like snacks or anything that might stain or even like crayons or markers because it'll be easy to clean so cute it also comes in blue and beige Olivia's starting school soon and I saw this for a dollar I couldn't believe it I'm mostly using it for her clothes can you believe that you can get a customizable stamp on Timo for a dollar? Isn't that wild? I already tried it on her sleeping sack and I washed it and it didn't come off, which is great news. I've said this before, I'm not usually a Disney girly, but I love like an understated Disney thing. And this Mickey claw clip was too cute to resist. I need to send this link to my friend. <laughs> then I got the very viral very popular tiktok hair wax stick this is to make your hair just kind of like stay in place i will try it and let you guys know because i just washed my hair and i don't want to put this on it i know i don't show y'all a lot of toys i'm still planning on doing a whole video on olivia's favorite team of things but this has by far been one of her favorites it's a color and number sorting hedgehog or porcupine i don't really know what animal this is this was only four bucks and it keeps her busy. She learns her numbers, her colors, and it's really good for practicing fine motor skills. She's obsessed, this was so inexpensive. Both me and my husband had to hide this from her yesterday. She wouldn't stop playing with it. She wanted to go to sleep and take a nap with it. Just like this fidget toy it has numbers and colors, three bucks, and probably one of her top five favorite toys right now. This one is really cool on Amazon. You can find it for double or triple the price. I got it for $10. It comes with the little cards. Olivia loves this thing. If you have a boy or a girl toddler, I swear it's so entertaining even i find myself playing with it sometimes i know we are way too early to be doing this but i had to because they already sold out i got some fall slash halloween plates for my collection i got these cutie pink pumpkins this fabulous wig and then this one i thought was pretty cute <laughs> so i'm gonna save those to do a fun little halloween thing with olivia more plates because i cannot help myself i got the cutest little animals this lion comes with eight for three bucks and i also got the zebra from that same seller every single time i see a cute plate i have to snatch it up because chances are by the time i need it i won't be able to find it on timu one of my first timu purchases was these little food cutters but i quickly learned that it's really a pain to get them out if they don't have this spring this spring makes it so easy to take them out so i upgraded to these they were just a few more dollars and definitely so much more worth it it comes with a ton i just grabbed four to show you i've been wanting this for a while it's a meat like ground meat smasher and it really gets in there and not a lot gets stuck on the actual utensil, which I really like. I got it for like a dollar. I got this cutie little seashell necklace with a little pearls and it has like a starfish. This is for Olivia. I'd rather just buy her like cheaper jewelry like this. This is like two bucks rather than like give her my nice jewelry. So I think she's gonna love this. I'm trying to do a makeover for our guest bedroom slash my filming room. I already started with the wallpaper and I got a few more prints from that shop that I told y'all I love. Just looks like real 
paintings, you know? And someone told me that I shouldn't say that art is public domain and yes, sorry, I'm gonna correct myself. Some of the art in the museums by very big popular artists are public domain, like you can go on their website and download them and print them yourself. That's what I meant, um, but of course, support local artists and smaller artists if you're able to but i just wanted like affordable this kind of vibe of painting so i got the prints from timo and i am on the hunt for like thrifted frames for that vintagey look so i have this little cottage and then i have the second print i already have this one this is called like central park something i'm sorry i'm butchering that but i have the first one too these were around five dollars each and the quality is truly great i definitely misread the sizing i got a toddler size five olivia is almost an eight so unfortunately these have to go back they're so cute little toddler like ug look-alike believe it or not my husband is also obsessed with timu he actually heard from timu before i did from y'all he is always on it like looking at stuff and this is one of the things he wanted to cut around the corners for like baseboards molding and like putting flooring basically you like put it on the floor where you want the cut to be and then you are able to trace it on the baseboard or the wood or whatever you need to cut this one was pretty like small and compact but it works for what we needed it and it was very very inexpensive and it also has if you can see the measurements right there this is another home improvement item this is to be able to cut things at an angle um this one is really really good quality it was 10 on Timo though so not cheap but it's actual metal it feels sturdy we have yet to try it but i'm glad we have it you know what's crazy i had these in my amazon exact same ones these feel so nice and heavy and sturdy y'all i got them for five dollars i think i got a 20 pack amazon had them for like almost 39 i'm not even kidding maybe the quality is better but these just feel so nice and look nice I'm just gonna go for these, obviously. I don't know if I should consider this a fail. I just expected it to be a little bit bigger. I feel like I couldn't really fit much in here. The Amazon ones are like probably like twice the width. So I feel like I could fit all my makeup brushes. This one, I could probably fit a couple or like just the eyeshadow ones. So I'm gonna keep because it's been too long and I don't even think I could return it anymore. But I would go for a thicker one for sure. I also got fishing wire from Timu. Honestly, I don't even know where else you could get fishing wire. Probably Amazon, Home Depot, I don't know. But I'm using this for Olivia's birthday, so I thought I would share. Because it's perfect to hang balloons, to tie balloons, to hang things from the ceiling that you don't want, you know, the string to be visible. I think this is going to come in handy. So guys, that's everything for today's video. I have another one coming up, like, very soon. Another Timu video, but a little bit different and very exciting. So stay tuned for that. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys very soon in my next one. Bye!